Starting in three, two, one. Hello, everyone, and welcome back to Four Pixels. Coco and Moon are here, and we are continuing Saiken and Setsu oh, 3. Oh boy. Here it is, the Moon Monastone. Uh, we somehow got it out. Don't ask <laughs> how. Keeping the forest in an eternal light night. Luna just spat it right fucking back out like that. <laughs> <laughs> like that. Uh, where did that fucking faker go? Like, I gotta find him to find the twink, you know what I'm saying? If he were here, I'd sense his phony presence, but I don't. <laughs> Maybe he left. <sighs> Alright, well, where's that Mirage Palace? If they take the sword, my grandpa's twink will be gone for good. We gotta go get the sword. Let's head for Dior, as King Richard said. That's where the last spirit should be. Right, Blorf's not dad. What? Captain Tsubasa. Uh, uh, huh? Ooh, I, just, I don't know. I don't know. <coughs> Excuse me. Well, well bless you. <laughs> I'm not over the baby, by the way. <laughs> I'm gonna be thinking about that for a while. I wish, that, like, uh, as you go through this place, every now and then you just see, like, the bushes <laughs> ruffling. <laughs> <laughs> and like, the, the hmm, head po po pops there? out for a second. Yeah. yeah. Y'all aren't, aren't letting me get a hidden edgewise. Holy shit. Boy, he turned into a horned uh, <laughs> skull. Ogre box, ogre box, yeah! Man, <laughs> after the how the first one went, I know everyone's gonna be like, man, what the fuck was Coco talking about? <laughs> I can't believe Coco was such a wuss. Oh my god. Oh my god. You know what, because of the, the palette that they chose to use for this dude, he looks like Bowser, uh, like a mimic <laughs> that decided to uh, cosplay Bowser. That's what he looks like. Except for he's got a little cape, so maybe I it's see how much damage and does. Bowser. Because, like, right now I'm we're scared. not doing a lot of damage to him. We're only doing one in three. Oh, there we go. Yeah. Alright. Oh, alright. Well, he's super Does give good EXP, though. Yeah. The Penga's just too powerful. <laughs> the Penga's carrying this team. Mm-hmm. And her strong... Strong beefy shoulders arms. and her beefy arms. What else? What haven't I tried? I think I've tried them all. Just, just murder. Just murder them. It's fine. Also, uh, it's unnerving that we are fighting wolves still. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, guys. Uh, we kind of made friends here, so, uh... Eh, well, we made friends with Kevin. Does anyone respect Kevin? Not really. <laughs> <laughs> the fact that he's the heir is, like, kind of fucking hilarious, because the implications are... The dad was just like, yeah, I'm just gonna throw him out there. You know, like, we do with our children normally. I hate this fucking clown. I hate this fucking clown! Get out of here! I think it's Go cute. Win. <laughs> He's hitting me though, and I want him to go away. He's hitting on I get you. It. He's hitting me. No. <laughs> Very bad. Very bad conclusions. At least it's not as bad as those lizards, so. When when you do that, also, I I forgot to point out that that sprite looks like uh she has completely uh one eighty her spine. Yep. Mhm. Mm yep. It's very painful looking. That's why I wasn't sure what she was doing to begin with. I, I really like this forest. It is very, uh, like, my color palette. I really like it. I just wanna check some things before we... Cause I know this isn't the right direction to go to the back to the city, but I wanna just make sure... No, I don't have any multi. And never mind. 
don't waste my time right now, because I can just whack on him with my a weapon. And it gives us a little, little EXP too. <sighs> Another magic seed. We want mystery seeds though. We won't be finding those in this area, though. You gotta go to a very specific area for those. Yeah. I think you mentioned that last time. Well, last time you were brought up, not like last episode. The power of the gaze. Damn it, Penga. Ow. Rude. That's a lot of knockback. Mm-hmm. I'm, I'm just gonna- there's- it seems like there's no detriment to doing full party heal, so... I'm just gonna heal anyway. A tiny bit lower, but like, it's at this point where either one still pretty much fills up to full HP. Yeah. I think this is back to the tower. Oh no. Uh, maybe? No. This looks like where we came in, actually. I think this is a dead end. remembered uh when i was watching the ace attorney bloopers uh they would just edit in loud horribly wet fart noises and i was like <laughs> crying <laughs> because it was like oh god that's appalling <laughs> why have you done this because it started off with it was just uh phoenix's voice actor making the noise with his mouth but then it progressed into the fucking sound team putting them in on the fucking reel and he was like Ugh. No. Where are we? Oh, okay. Maybe we won't be Guess able that to enter my question. Here. Let me in! Let me in! <laughs> Let me in! They, like, Miles pull forward. down a second gate. <laughs> yeah. Oh, just like in the fucking Overwatch thing. Fucking <laughs> three gates down because Seahawks in sight. <laughs> Keep the gremlin out! Don't want to let it eat in here. Somehow Seaf is known coast to coast as a buffet clearer. If only I had a stomach like that excessive, to be honest. Like, that was always like something I really liked about in Dragon Ball, because aside from them making the food look like really fucking good, um I just I really I really just wanted to eat a lot of food. Oh man, I feel that. I've- I've been having such a hankering for Katadon. Oh my god. We- we made, uh... What do you call it? Yeah, we- we made, um... Pork cutlet, uh, katsu. Uh, and oh my god, that was, like, the best to just have that, finally, after, like, fucking five months of this shit. <laughs> I might make- I might make some myself. It's- like, the recipe was super easy to follow. It's just that there's a lot of steps. So, Aye. like... Matt's taught me how to make mm. some. Oh, really? Mm-hmm. That's so fun. Like, it was really fun to do that with Scott. So, I imagine having Ray yeah, and Kiedane really fucking awesome. helping you <laughs> learn learn the recipe. What is that? Oh. so unintelligible as a sprite it was like what the fuck is that it looks like a stick on the ground oh it's a grave okay 
uh, for a beloved dog uh, that raised him, I think? I don't remember. Uh, this is, this is a weird, or... goofy, goofies and Pluto situation that I think Carl's just a regular dog, but we don't know. <laughs> We're really not sure what's going on here. Like, I can, like, kind of follow the the idea of, like, in, in the Mickey Mouse-verse, if you will, uh, of the idea of there being dogs just like there's monkeys with humans, where it's <laughs> not a one-to-one -one situation of, oh yeah, we definitely were the same thing or are the same thing, but one of us is just wearing pants, because that's fucking terrifying. <laughs> like, does that mean, like, Pluto, like, logistically speaking, that sounds like Pluto's got a king. <laughs> like, <laughs> and that's like really logistically terrible mentally. <laughs> like, it's like, no, thank you. I don't want to consider that. So, like, the idea that, okay, the Beast Men are like descended from some like crossover or similar thing that had more evolutionary uh, strides or something would be fine. But these dudes look like fucking the same. <laughs> it's very weird. I did not know that there was even a bat here. <laughs> I'm getting wailed on. I'm like, okay, I'm just gonna heal the entire party. <laughs> Let me hit, hit him with the bee. There we go. I feel like I'm going crazy, but I am... I'm slowly getting accustomed to wasps being around me so much that I'm actually beginning to find them cute, and it's really cramping my mental <laughs> style. Oh, dear. Because I was very much brought up to fear wasps. <laughs> I'm like, I don't know what to do with this, this, uh, like, relaxed state that I've gotten into. Like, it's really dumb. It's like, it's just a bug, what do I fucking care? <laughs> it's like, wait a minute. You, you were trained to run from these things, what are you doing? Like yesterday I took a picture of one that was sitting like on the window, looking... Looking cute for better, like lack of a better word. And I was like, this is amazing that I'm not terrified of these things anymore. <laughs> I don't know if your parents were ever like that. Nope. Both my mother and my aunt, who took care of me an awful lot when I was a kid, were terrified of yellow jackets, bees, and wasps. So, like, anytime there was one in the vicinity, uh, they were booking it with child in tow. So, like, uh, <laughs> I was I was dragged along quite frequently in the, oh no, bees! <laughs> <laughs> running segment at the zoo or <laughs> wherever the fuck we were outside. <laughs> Very weird. Because right now, in my garden, all the all the wasps want to do is get a drink. Like, they come and they check out, like, my, my plants in general because there's flowers. But, like, I have a bird bath that they just want to drink out of. And it's like, oh, okay, I'll get you fresh water. Like, they give a fucking shit. Like, <laughs> I don't think, I don't think ants, uh, ants, I don't think wasps get, give much of a fuck about that. Like... It's water is water, probably, and that's the theme of things, but... Probably. Here, I'll get you cooler water, I guess? It's just fucking stupid. You will be remembered and spared. <laughs> Coco, you can't do stuff like that. You're, you're going to, like, make me paranoid that they will take over <laughs> my life and world. <laughs> but, I mean, if they do, at least you'll be spared. <laughs> I guess, yeah. I would be the ro the the royal water bearer or some shit. <laughs> God, wait. These flowers, I cannot pass. What the fuck? Hey. Ogre box. Ogre box. Nope. Okay. Oh. <laughs> Coco's tired. Where the fuck are we? Almost are we in the Lost Woods, Coco? <laughs> I think we're almost back. Maybe? I don't know. Boy, it, it sure is a, a game. A game in which we are lost. <laughs> Stop hitting me! You're being super rude, man. Oh, 
You know what Popenga, not Popenga, uh, you know what Blorf kind of reminds me of? Speaking of Dragon Ball, um, is, is Bulma, like, in original Dragon Ball, where she's, like, a hu- like, willfully a huge pervert, for some reason. <clears throat> like, I'll show you my ass if you give me a Dragon Ball. Like, <laughs> it's like, Bulma, you are 14! What the fuck? Like, that's what it feels like looking at Blorf shaking her- her ass to kill the enemy. <laughs> I mean, they're gonna die, so you know. Ass. Yeah. She's got an ass so heinous that, uh, <laughs> that they just fucking die. <laughs> like, okay, imagine though, you, have you ever seen that Hank Hill clip where they're talking about how Hank has like a concave ass? What if that's Blorf? Oh my god. Blorf Don't, come on, shut, no, 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 no. Don't ruin her for me. <laughs> Well, I was just thinking about how, like, the, the the art, the official art from the original, like, is that, that, like, long leg, long stick leg, basically, and it's like, there can't be an ass attached to that, there's just no way! <laughs> Blorf the assless. <laughs> That's K20. the real reason her mother abandoned her. <laughs> you didn't get my ass, you've gotten Richard's ass, that means I can't love you anymore. <laughs> Or ever. It's okay, Papenga likes her ass. <laughs> she likes some stick skinny. <laughs> oh, man, no, if she sees fine. olive oil, she's... she'll just pass out. <laughs> I forgot olive oil existed. Holy shit. Now that's the that's the original uh, uh matchstick girl. <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit. Uh, she, she, uh... she was that real rubber hose era. So we gotta go to the blinky dot, correct? There's correct? only one red dot left. Alright, yeah. The only problem with this map is it's kind of hard to navigate with all the little, like, blockages. Yeah. Ah. Uh, but. There we go. Yay! They should I just have an arrow that says beach here. Wait, this might be... The one. Is oh, no, this again? is right. Oh! What will you do? Uh. Apparently. What's this plant doing here? It's, it's from the Moonlight Forest. Now, uh, let's see. Just pull it up by the roots. And we're good. The Lampflower Forest. Oh, huh. this is where my parents fucked. Sorry. <laughs> uh, I'm from here. There. Let's 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 say that for Sia. <laughs> the fucking horrible idea of oh yeah, saying my parents banged here. Um my grandpa said the elf village Dior was there. Was 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 here. There? Question mark. The forest has to have a secret. Sure, Carly, why not? Ooh. Oops. Okay, I'm I'm clocking ones. Uh, let's try a uh, machine golem. There's so many worms. Caterpies, angry caterpies. Very angry caterpies. Spider web? No, you mean string shot. <laughs> Evade rate down. Okay. Brain immediately on that last unicorn shit. <laughs> oh! <clears throat> Just okay. Just okay. Uh... Which way? This way. Uh-oh. What? Oh, okay! You just take a nap, it'll be fine! I need to heal. First, and then I'll fix that. Or maybe that woke you up, question mark? Nope. Yes, okay. I didn't have to wake you up. Excellent. So 
we like to hear. I fuck for Fapanga. I can't fucking see. It keeps going crunchy on me for some reason. A mega crawler, oh boy. Is that a bee or a fairy? That's the lady bee. That is adorable. Kinda reminds me of a random figure I went and bought at an anime convention. Which, I think she was from some kind of, um... Dark- I think it's a dark stalker she was from? Uh, she's like a bee character that's got, like, two other sisters or something. She's like a TNA bee. Hm. Well, it's kind dark of stalkers. It's kind of to be expected. Yeah. I don't know much about dark suckers. I just know visually, uh, there's a lot of titty, so... I don't even know what the game plays like! Neither do I, but game. that's where, uh, Morgana and Lilith are from. Yeah, and I think that's- that's a fighting game. Cause I don't think- I think I would have heard by now if it was, like, some kind of RPG or, you know? Yeah. I keep getting confused why Papanga is leading. <laughs> I'm very smart. Hmm. What are we supposed to be trying to find? Dior. Dior. Okay, so we are looking for a town. Yeah. I'm getting my ass handed to me. I like the the visual effect on the flowers. That's really pretty. Yeah. I don't know. Fucking copycat. <laughs> yeah, literally. And then she fucking died. Way to go. <laughs> she tried too hard and died for it. Good. Just like any lol player. I didn't even play that game. <laughs> Where the fuck did that come from? Hold on a minute. My game suddenly went pickle juice color. Hmm. Very peculiar. <laughs> Ah, yes, I am missing all my shots. Fuck you, you weird little... I don't know, is this Tom Nook? <laughs> it's one of the Nooklings. <laughs> oh my god! Timmy, why are you doing this? Get out of here! I'm getting my ass handed to me. Constantly. I'm just gonna go back to single, since I keep having to heal myself. <laughs> Bastard man. <sighs> oh, it's me. It's I did you. want agility. I need to be faster. Stronger. Sounds like there's a car rubbing behind me that's really tiny. <laughs> Hot Wheels, that's what they're called. A small Hot Wheels is, is revving behind me. Oh hey, a box! Ogre box! Ogre box! Ogre <laughs> box! Ogre box! Kia box! Kia box! Kia box! Kia box! <laughs> now okay. that you mentioned it, it kind of looks like Bowser. I can't see it. I know, right? Like, God. Also, uh, I was going to ask you if you had to pick for, uh, like, 
who would best fit each of these characters? Who would you put like out of the the let's play group or just your friend group in general? Oh. Uh, hmm. Who do you think would like to play them? Let's let's phrase it like that. Wait, like like if they like, were to join like the game and playing... play it or Yes. Like if if you like were like let's just play some Seekin. Uh, and it also worked as three player because let's stipulate that also. <laughs> yeah. Um. I think I think Ray would like to play as Carly because, like, as I said when she first played the game, Carly was her. Um, was the one that Person. she chose when she first played. Yeah. So she has a soft spot for her. Mm -hmm. Um. Hmm. I think Kaden would like to play Angela, <laughs> just because of the booty shaking, not like because he's like excited by that just because he would find it hilarious <laughs> maybe i'm trying to think like in terms of play style which of the characters he would prefer i'm not familiar with his play style yet so like i i only yeah. know anecdotal stuff from like overwatch and like that that even even so is like eh, you know because you have to be flex in, in a game like that in, um, let's see, when we played, uh, Dark Souls, his character, he went for, like, a super tanky heavy hitter one that, like, could take people out one hit. So, maybe just going off that, Durin, but I honestly don't know. Uh, fuck. Uh, <laughs> Ah, uh, yes, this is... But I forget what it is that tips you off. Oh, we are in the Lost Woods! Holy shit! Yeah, now we are. Uh, let me see. see. Well, it's Oops. got arrows. And it's got a center flower section. Let's so see. Da, 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 da. You have to have definitely a, a specific combination. Okay, one, two, blue, this is Dior, the beach. Carly's on your team, she'll recognize the play next place that the forest must hold a secret. If she's not on a team, you'll meet her just a little further down. She'll storm off after a chat, head southwest and beat up monsters here. She'll reveal the secret of the plant, but not if she's with you, apparently. The secret is that the flowers glow in the dark. If you follow the red plants, they will take you to Dior. Red plants? I did see a couple of those somewhere um... else. It's not too I hard. think that was when we were at the edge of this place. It's in case it's daytime. Go from fuck from where you met Carly the second time. All right, south, southwest, south, southeast. Um, all right, let me try and do this, but it's on my phone that I'm looking at it, so. <sighs> Alright, yeah, so let me see. Oh. I don't know if this is the right second to do this one, but... What? Well, hopefully we can make it work. Well... God, Papenga is so awesome. Uh-oh. Snooze time! Timmy. Timmy, no. Uh, never stops being funny. Oh god. It's so fucking funny. Yeah, you shitty tanuki. Da 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 da. Flap. Both of you scared me! Oh! <laughs> I thought a spider was climbing my leg. She just put her whiskers on me. <laughs> Aww. At least I didn't kick out, because that's happened to quote before from Scott. Like he he luckily didn't like move his leg fast, so it just like pushed her away. But still, it was like, oh no. See, I think it's a okay, here it's down. Says, here it says southwest. So I'm not sure if this is referring to the area we're at yet, but. Because the thing is that the flowers grow red at night. 
Aren't we at night, though? I don't think so. Maybe. I don't know. Did they give you, a, like, a clock to go by? Wait, let me see something. Um... No, it's daytime. So, yeah, this is gonna be tough. We have to wait for the time to go. South. I don't know. What's wrong? Quilty decided to, that she wanted to be in my lap. So I'm letting Coco drive. Seems like we're coming in different areas, at least. Sort of. No. I don't think- no, I don't think we're making progress. Okay, so let's just stand out here until it's night, like nighttime. I don't know if it'll change while we're. Well, maybe. Well, considering that, like that area seems very conditional to the time of day, whereas this area seems like it could have the passage of time. Yeah. Like, you know, like entering a dungeon versus not. Oh, yeah. Let's just stand here for a minute. Accidentally hit a thing. No, it's me. I was just checking. Oh, okay. The lesbians are frolicking. <laughs> Got the slow burn of Papenga and Blorf, though. Hmm? The slow burn of Papenga and Blorf. <laughs> Papenga is completely fucking oblivious, and Blorf's just. Girl, hot. <laughs> she's just, she's new at this gay shit. Meanwhile, I think Papenga, living in an Amazonian style, uh, insular area, was just like, huh, there's a girl here. <laughs> I want, I want it to be that Papenga is super oblivious, just because, uh, it would be extra funny. Yes. That, are we dating, uh, uh, it, does this girl like me, or is she just friendly, promotional, sort of, <laughs> promotional content. I don't know why I'm saying promotional content. It's the brain starting to slow down. Maybe this is the right way? I mean, we did not save anything earlier, so... Maybe we accidentally found the town? Maybe that's for something else. I don't know. Well, I do remember this area. I think. Or this might just look like another area we experienced. I think it might, because we didn't come across the golden statue before, did we? No, we didn't. No. I'm talking about, like, this corner area. It looks familiar, but I'm not sure why. Hmm. Okay. We must move forward before we start hitting things, CF. Come on. Yeah, I don't think we... Mm -hmm. No. Alright. Mm -hmm. Well, then let's go to the other... end... over here. Yeah, this okay, is this is end. something we've experienced, I don't think, but this is a dead end. Or wait, no, there's a- no, that, never mind, that's not impassable. The Penga's so well armored, she barely takes any damage. Meanwhile, Blorf and Siaf are, like, struggling. <laughs> She's so beefy! And that's why Blorf is gay. Mm. 
I just tried to jump in game. Why did I have the urge to do that? <laughs> Nothing happens there. I don't think time is passing here. I Let think me... I was wrong. Let me check something. I just... Alright, so that's where... The golden statue is. But... Um, I guess that's where our path is. Okay, okay, I think I got it. I found it. with <laughs> destroyed brain. Caterpie, why are you being a dick right now? <laughs> I can't believe Blorf was twerking before twerking. <laughs> I'll start or was you, she the Blorf, damn you. <laughs> What if Blorf was the future of twerking? That this mm. is so far in the future that twerking had to come back. <sighs> but Pega has taken a total of six damage. <laughs> so fucking. <laughs> like, she's, so, she's so chunky. Me and Blorf fucking. God damn. Okay, we're at like dusk right now. There we go. Yay! Coco didn't even need it. Flower Garden Land Dior. Huh. Cute. Someone's grave is here. Well. And with that, sure we will go ahead and end this episode right here. Thank you folks for joining us. <laughs> Yo, <laughs> What's up, bud? Huh? Are you going somewhere? What's up? Come here. What's up? <laughs> Holy shit! This is the best! <laughs> I've cornered him! <laughs> I can kill him! I need a swing! <laughs> Who needs that old one? Oh.